welcome back into the show. Today, Legoland Florida is celebrating the debut of their all-new Brick Beards Water Sports Stunt Show and Pirate Fest weekends. The show is stacked with stunts, including world-renowned daredevil Nick Walenda as he walks across a high wire, get this, 60 feet in the air. Ooh, I get chills just thinking about it. I had a chance to speak with him this morning just four hours before he performed, so check it out. Hi, Nick. Welcome to the show. Thanks for having me on. No problem. Now, by the time this airs, you will have already performed your high wire walk, and it's actually about four hours from now. Is this just another day in the office for you? Because I would be somewhere meditating, praying, <laughs> like really scared. <laughs> yeah. It, it is somewhat another day in the office. However, there's always a unique aspect to everything that I do. And today I'm dealing with uh, a balancing pole that is covered in Legos, which is exciting for me. However, it's challenging because it's, it's doubled the weight of my balancing pole that I'm used to using. Uh, it has actually gone from about 35 pounds to over 70 pounds. So that is certainly something that will uh, create a challenge. I'm always up for a challenge, but it also creates a little bit of nervousness. Uh, but I have been very, very busy leading up to it, of course, uh, uh, many, many interviews, dealing with the media, talking with the media, and, and meeting with guests as well. Oh, my goodness. Now, when you do your high wire walks, I've noticed that you hold uh, a stick. Does that keep your balance? That's right, yeah. So it's a balancing pole, and that's what will be actually covered in Legos today uh, during that walk uh, is that balancing pole. Oh, my goodness. If you didn't have it, do you think it would, it would make it just impossible to do this walk? Not impossible. Uh, however, the way that this walk is rigged, it would make it a, a huge challenge, uh, as well as dealing with the elements and, uh, of course, the fact that I want to walk with Legos. Right. And, Nick, you've been doing this for a long time. So I have to ask, how old were you when you tried your first high wire walk? Well, my mom was six months pregnant with me and still walking the wire, so uh, I was about, uh, it was three months before I was put my feet on terra firma. But um, in reality, I started about 18 months old walking on the wire myself and have done it my entire life. My family's done it for seven generations and uh, since the 1780s. Oh my goodness. Okay, so your mom is a superhero. Got it. Because <laughs> six months pregnant, I want to be somewhere with my feet up, not worrying about anything. But if this is what you do for work, what do you do for fun? <laughs> well, I do this for work and fun, and I think that's one of the blessings, and I think it's, it's very seldom that people are able to find that, but I have so much passion for what I do that this is not just a job to me or an occupation, but it is my life. My great-grandfather said it best when he said, life is on the wire and everything else is just waiting. And in fact, I just wrote a new book, and it's called Facing Fear, and in that book, I talk about how I'm so blessed to be able to, to have an occupation that I love, that isn't, you know, I've never worked a day in my life because I love it so much and I'm so passionate about it. And in that book, I encourage people to pursue their dreams and their passions because I do believe so many people are held back and working in a job that they're not happy in but they're complacent in because of fears. Absolutely. I completely agree with that. Um, now, tell me a little bit about today's stunt show. Yeah, so there is a stunt show called Brickbeard's Water Sports Stunt Show that takes place every day here at Legoland Resort in Florida. It, it features some of the greatest athletes, water sports athletes from around the world. And again, you're able to come see this show anytime. I had the honor of seeing a preview the other day, and I was at the edge of my seat during that entire performance. So I highly encourage anybody to make sure they come out and check out this incredible water sports show. Yes, I can't wait. <laughs> you know, you just said that you were doing all of these interviews. I hope that you get some time to yourself before you go walk that high wire because I can only imagine how crazy it's going to be. Um, but thank you so much for joining me. I appreciate your time. And like I said, get some rest before you take on that crazy stunt. Yes. And can you tell my audience where they can go for no more information? For Absolutely. If they go to Legoland Florida's website, they're able to get information, of course, on park hours times. Or if they go to Legoland's YouTube channel, they'll actually be able to see the walk itself. Awesome. Thank you so much.